protest like the others and the one coming up tomorrow, all providing a test for Austin police. KXAN's Leslie Rangel is live at the Capitol with a look at what local law enforcement is doing to help make sure everything goes smoothly. Leslie. That's right, Shannon. At least for tonight, we can say that it was a success, not only for the Austin Police Department, but also for the community who was out here to protest and he let their voices be heard. Now, earlier I spoke with some parents because, of course, there was concern that maybe chaos could erupt given what had happened in other cities across the country. Parents said that they were willing to bring their children out here and trust that our law enforcement could keep their family safe. I'd like to see what is uh, what it's like for him to see what it's like to express your First Amendment rights, uh, right to gather, right to assemble, right to free speech. Well, so. they're just as invested, if not more, in uh, in America's future, and they'll be impacted um, perhaps longer and more uh, more importantly um, than we will be. A new generation experiencing a new page in American politics. You no, know, it's not the happiest day for a lot of people. So getting together with other people who may feel like-minded. Uh, you know, kind of helps you deal with it, I think. Thousands gathered. <laughs> and Austin police were ready to make sure everyone stayed safe. It was a peaceful crowd. Uh, a lot of uh, police, but they're standing back, so yeah, I feel safe. Parents happy to show their children how to spread a message peacefully. Uh, just this many people, uh, raw emotion, so I think you should have some security, some EMS. I mean, I think Austin is prepared for this type of event. Now we did check with the Austin Police Department just minutes ago just to confirm that there were still no arrests made related to any protests or rallies and that still remains the case. No arrests have been made. For now we're live at the Capitol. Leslie Rangel, KXAN News.